Greetings y'all. I am Carolina Ramirez, Assistant Principal of Tesla High School with your Border Collie What to Know for October 16th to October 22nd. All information shared in this message is also posted on the school website and social media as well as our Discord server. Wednesday, October 19th, which is tomorrow, is the next early release professional development date. Students will be released by 1.15 p.m. Please make sure arrangements for rides have been made. Teachers will be engaged in professional development meetings. Students will not be allowed to stay on campus. Next week, seniors will be participating in college application week. The purpose is to assist students with confirming their career choice before graduation. Counselors will be working with students in small group sessions that are planning on attending two or four year colleges or universities. Invited support staff will work with those students that are considering the military or workforce or other post-graduation journey. Information will be disseminated through English teachers or direct from their counselor. We have our fall orchestra concert scheduled for Thursday October 20th at 7 p.m. in the Amazon Prime Center. This is a joint concert with the Santa Angela Middle School Orchestra program. Admission is by donation. Please come out to support our arts. Congratulations to Elizabeth Larson and Ashton Marion. They were crowned Tesla High School 2022 Homecoming Queen and King. Tesla had a wonderful spirit week and I want to acknowledge all of the students that supported the activities from the dress-up days, the powder puff events, pep rally, the game and the dance. I especially want to thank the faculty and staff for all the additional work and time the committed outside of teaching during the regular schedule. Many staff members put in an additional 40 hours of work to make this a success. That is the Border Collie spirit. Hoo hoo. 11th and 12th grade students, Tesla will offer the ASVAB on November 9th to all registered 11th and 12th grade students. With the large number of mid-year graduates shortly after the ASVAB and a greatly expanded three-year graduate list, this may be an excellent option for those pending graduates who may not have a solid post-graduation plan. Registration forms are due to Mrs. Stonebridge no later than November 4. Say something anonymous reporting for students will take place next week. The SARS is an online system implemented for stakeholders to share information to assist with ensuring safety of others. In addition, information regarding the annual SOS, Signs of Suicide, training will be distributed next week with a call going out to families to explain the program. Students and parents, please be aware that any student that videos, records, and or pass on or post staff and student actions without consent and that impact the confidentiality of other students will receive a disciplinary action. This includes anything not first shared with the administration as an intervention. Any student interested in an opportunity to obtain volunteer hours, please see Mrs. Larson in Student Services. It's important to begin working on those SAT hours now. Some sadness and sorrow was given when our custodian, Lizzie, was leaving the school today. I was too upset to explain the athletic events and other events in general. This is Carolina Ramirez, saying, I have some really exciting news. I just saved a bunch of money on my car insurance by switching to Geico. On a side note. This ends our Border Collie What to Know for this week. Bye for now. GEICO. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance.